welcome back in this session we are going to discuss about discuss a problem of printing a given matrix printing a given matrix which is a two dimensional list for python in clockwise direction in spiral form assume that a matrix given is the matrix whose first row 5 by 5 matrix this is first row and this is the second row number 3 this is row number 4 this is last row okay so let us print the matrix in spiral form the two in clockwise direction by now you might have understood what we are going to print 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 then 17 18 19 then 20 21 22 23 24 25 okay so how many rows are there For the out of the matrix, five by five. Okay. Let us define four variables. Row start, our starting row. Starting row is starting column is zero. Index of starting row and starting column is zero. Index of ending row and ending column is is n minus one. Okay. So is n minus one. And the number of columns, a number of rows. Okay, so let it be four only because this is a fixed matrix. So why unnecessarily one more variable here? Okay, now while while starting row is less than or equal to ending row and starting column is less than or equal to is less than or equal to ending column. Okay, so while rows or columns are not finished. Do this. So first, let us print first row. First row. In first row, what is constant? Row is constant. What is variable? Column is variable. So I write down for for column in range from where to where from column start to column end. From column start to column end. So column end is four. So you. To stop at four, it must be five. Okay. Print what? Print all elements of first row. So matrix name is A. What is row for it? Starting row, right? What is column? Which is variable? Okay. After printing it, have have one blank space. Finished. Now first row is finished. We are stepping into the last column. First row is finished. You should start from printing. You should start printing from second row. So starting row, starting row should be incremented by one. Okay. So what is variable here? What is variable here? Row number. Row number. Okay. Row varies from starting row to ending row. For row in range. A row in range, starting row to ending row. Ending row is four, so as far as Python syntax is concerned, it must be er plus one. Okay, increment is increment is one. So what do you print? Print all the elements of last row, last column. What is constant? What is constant? Row number is varying. What is constant? Column. What is that column? Last column. That is end column. Okay. Is end column. This is starting column and end column. Starting column and end column. The starting row and end row. Okay. Now this is uh, end column and space and space. 
So what is done? First row is done, last column is done. Now you, you'll have to start from here. This is one less than end column. So what is end column? One less than the previous one. So you print from end column to start column. For column in range, column in range, end column to start column. Okay. So to stop here, you must go, you must give one index after this, minus one. What is the in increment minus one? So again, print. What is constant here? What is constant here? Row number. What is that row and row? Okay. What is variable column? Fine. So have a blank space again. No. So this is done. This is done. This is also done. No. No, you have to print from 14. Where is 14? This is row and minus one. Or end row minus one. So what is end row? What is end row? End row is end row minus one. Okay. So this is no longer ending row. This is now ending row. Okay. So for row in range from where to where? From end row to start row. To stop at start row, must put start row minus one. Increment is minus one. Okay. So what do you print now? What do you print? You print A of oh, variable is row and column is start column. Okay. Comma and is equal to this. So you you printed this also. Then you should step into next column. So starting column is no longer this. Now this is starting column. For that to be starting column, so you increment starting column by one. You increment starting column by one. Okay. The cycle repeats. Let us see what output we get. Save it. Syntax error. Spellings. Let us run it again and see the output. For row in range. Run it again and see the output. Again, I got to put parentheses here. So, first row, okay. first row. And then one, two, three, four, five, the first row. Six, seven, eight, five, six, seven, eight, nine is last column. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 is the last row. Then 13, 14, 15, 16. And then 17, 18, 19. And then 20, 21. And then 22, 23. And then 24, 22. Please check. Okay. This is printing the matrix in spiral form in clockwise direction. Okay, so hope you understand it. So thanks for watching. Keep watching and keep subscribing. We'll come up with more videos, more interesting videos and more innovative videos.